literally a world away and just spellbinding for us mere mortals. China's spacecraft is currently exploring our neighboring planet. What's it up to? It's the gist. We now have images that Tianwen once sent back to Earth. A big reminder, Mars is 190 million kilometers away. If it take a few thousand kilometers. So even this video of the precious 10 seconds showing snippets of the landing sequence is for the history books or digital archives for that matter. Also groundbreaking, the very capacity of Tianwen-1. You see, it's composed of an orbiter, the mothership that makes observations from above, a lander, something to reach the surface, and a rover, a moving probe that explores the ground. No other mission has attempted all three in one go. Much attention is now on the rover, Zhurong, named after the god of fire in ancient Chinese mythology. Side note, what we call the red planet in English, the Chinese call the planet of fire, hence Zhurong. But back to our rover. Powered by the sun, Zhurong weighs around a quarter of a ton. It's equipped with six instruments, including cameras, ground-penetrating radar, a magnetic fuel detector, and weather sensors. The overall mission is vast, to examine the atmosphere and ground layers of Mars and look for evidence of water ice, anything that could help establish the conditions for life. Juro has a planned working life of 90 Martian days. That's about 93 days here on Earth. But if it's anything like its lunar roving cousin, the U-22, designed to work for three months and it's now in its third year, we could be hearing from the Chinese rover on Mars for a long time to come. Now, you have the gist.